If I had to describe Esta, the first word that comes to my mind is inspirational. Esta has redefined what it means for violence to be unacceptable. When I was still in college, I knew I wanted to do something about trauma, and I didn't realize it at the time, but Esta's work was already influencing me. And if you're serious about ending violence in our state, in our country, in the world, Esta is your person. One of the things I think that makes domestic violence so challenging is it's been with us since humans have related to one another. And historically, it's been thought of as a private issue. So it was something that happened between families, behind closed doors, it was not something that we talked about in polite society. One of the revolutions with pioneers like Esther Solar has been bringing that conversation into the open and turning domestic violence from a private family matter into a public health issue. The passage of the Violence Against Women Act in 1994 could not have happened without ESTA. It brought federal dollars to the investigation and prosecution of violence against women. She doesn't stop with violence against women. She wants to include everybody. And she has made men and boys her partners and without the involvement of men and boys, we cannot stop domestic violence. One of the things that makes Esther Solar and Future Without Violence unique is they have the ability to bring together leading academic institutions like UCSF and the amazing research that's being done on the intersections between healthcare and domestic violence and translate that into programmatic work. The movement that she's created has been really inspirational for me. The fact that HEARTS, my organization, has been supported not only by the UCSF Department of Psychiatry, but by the UCSF National Center of Excellence in Women's Health, and they have had long-standing partnerships with Futures Without Violence. We all feed each other in this work. The main lesson I have learned from Esta's work is that public policy is an essential component of clinical practice. We cannot help people to the extent that we have to without joining forces with people who are activists in the social policy realm. When I think of Esther as a person and what makes her unique is her incredible optimism that things can change. What's extraordinary about Esther Solar and Futures Without Violence is their ability to both see the future, influence the future, and change the future. Congratulations, Esther. You rock the world. You are amazing. Esther, I cannot think of a more worthy recipient of the UCSF medal. Thank you for everything you have done and continue to do.